Mastering the Art of Public Speaking, The Value and Techniques for Success Public speaking can help you to communicate more effectively with others, both in professional and personal settings. Being able to speak clearly and confidently in front of a group can help you to get your message across more skillfully, and to persuade others to see your point of view. Furthermore, public communication can help to build your confidence and self-esteem. It can be a challenging and intimidating experience to speak in front of a group, but by practicing, you will develop your communication abilities. Public speaking can also be a useful tool for networking and building relationships. Being able to speak effectively in front of others can help you to make a positive impression and to establish yourself as an expert in your field. Today we discuss 10 top tips to improve public speaking. Number 1. Practice, practice, practice. The key to improving your communication skills is to get plenty of practice. The more you present to an audience, the more relaxed and in control you will feel. There are many ways to practice, including joining a public speaking club or organization, giving presentations in class or at work, or even volunteering to speak at events or meetings. The key is to get as much experience as possible, so that you can become more relaxed in your abilities. One way to practice is to give presentations to small groups or to friends and family, this will enable you to get feedback on your delivery and content. As you become more capable, you can gradually increase the size of your audience. Another way to practice is to record yourself delivering a speech, and then watch the recording. This will assist you to identify areas for improvement, such as pacing, use of visual aids, and body language. Number 2. Know your material. For a successful presentation, be sure to thoroughly prepare and have a good understanding of your topic beforehand, anticipating any common questions that might be asked. Number 3. Use visual aids to support your points. Graphics and slides can help to connect with your audience and make your vision clearer. There are many different types of visual aids that you can use, depending on the topic. Some examples include Slides or a presentation software like PowerPoint can help you to organize your material and to provide visual support for your speech. Providing your audience with handouts or other printed materials can help them to follow along and to refer back to key aspects later. Using photos or other images can help to illustrate your points and to make your presentation more visually interesting. Using physical props or demonstrations can help to make your speech more interactive and compelling. Number 4. Use simple, clear language. Avoid using jargon or complex vocabulary that your audience may not understand. Number 5. Engage and interact with your audience. Ask questions, encourage feedback, and use audience participation to keep them interested and involved. Number 6. Use appropriate body language and nonverbal communication. Make eye contact. This helps to establish a connection with your listeners and to show that you are committed. Use appropriate gestures, these can help to emphasize your key points and to add energy to your presentation. However, be sure not to overuse gestures or to use distracting or inappropriate ones. Vary your vocal tone, by using different vocal tones, you can competently emphasize key information and keep your viewers invested. Use facial expressions, these can help to convey your emotions and to engage your crowd. To exude credibility, make sure to maintain good posture while speaking. Stand upright and adopt a confident stance. Number 7. Use transitions to move between points. Use phrases like another point to consider is, or in conclusion, to help guide your audience through your speech. Number 8. Be mindful of your pacing. Speak neither too quickly nor too slowly, and pause for emphasis when appropriate. Number 9. Incorporating humor can help to break the ice, lighten the mood and is a great way to create a more relaxed atmosphere. A well-placed joke or humorous anecdote can help to calm you and your audience, and can make your presentation more enjoyable and memorable. However, it is important to use humor appropriately, as it can be a delicate element of public speaking. Number 10. Rehearse your presentation. 
Practice in front of a mirror or a small group to get feedback and to become more comfortable with your material. I hope you have found this helpful, let us know in the comments. Don't forget to follow for more hints and tips.